If you know Maya, you know she's got this unapologetic heart-centered vibe that commands attention. She's loyal and resilient and knows exactly how to balance loving others with loving herself. Maya Wilkes from Girlfriend She Woman who shows us exactly what it means to be magnetic, loyal, and fiercely independent. If you've ever wondered why Maya commands so much attention and respect, stick around. We're breaking down what makes her so captivating, and how you can channel a bit of her energy into your own life. So here's the thing about Maya, she's got this energy that's all about passion and loyalty, but she's no pushover. Maya's the type who will show up for her family, her friends, and her community. But she's not bending over backwards for people who don't deserve her energy. She's got this balance of giving her all, while still holding back enough to protect her own peace. This isn't about being selfish. It's about self-respect. Maya shows us that loyalty starts with knowing your work hand making sure the people in your life know it too. And let's talk about resilience. Maya doesn't come from wealth, she doesn't have everything handed to her, and life throws a lot her way. From relationship struggles to money problems, Maya faces challenges that could break anyone. But here's the thing she doesn't let them define her. Maya bounces back every single time, and each setback just makes her stronger. She teaches us that resilience isn't about ignoring the pain. It's about rising through it. It's that inner strength that makes her magnetic. People respect her because she respects herself enough to keep pushing forward. One of the most powerful things about Maya is her warmth. She's genuinely caring and has that big-hearted vibe that makes people feel safe around her. But don't confuse warmth with weakness. Maya's kindness comes with boundaries. She knows when to be there and when to step back. She's not here for fake friends or energy-draining situations. Being a lover archetype means she knows her limits and isn't afraid to enforce them. It's that mix of empathy and strength that makes her character so real and relatable. And can we just take a second to appreciate Maya's style? She's got that bold, confident look that says, I know who I am. For Maya. Style isn't just about fashion, it's a statement. It's about showing up as her authentic self, unapologetically. When you see her, you're seeing someone who's comfortable in her own skin, someone who isn't dressing to impress anyone but herself. Maya's style teaches us that when you look good for you, you radiate confidence, and that's something everyone notices. Maya Wilkes' story is a reminder that we set the tone for how people treat us. By prioritizing herself, setting boundaries, and staying true to her values, she teaches everyone around her to respect her. And that's the real magic here she's teaching us that when you put yourself first, the right people will value you even more. This isn't selfish, it's survival. Because if you're always pouring into others without pouring into yourself, you're going to run dry. Here's the hard truth, not everyone's going to love it when you start setting boundaries and putting yourself first. Some people might even call it selfish. But Maya shows us that it's okay to prioritize your well-being, your peace, and your happiness. The people who truly care will respect that, and the ones who don't, well, they were probably never really there for you to begin with. So if you're looking to level up, take a lesson from Maya Wilkes. Be passionate, be resilient, and love deeply but make sure that love starts with you. Protect your peace, know your worth, and don't settle for anything less. Maya reminds us that true magnetism comes from being unapologetically yourself, flaws and all. That's it for today's episode. If Maya Wilkes has inspired you to think about loyalty, love, or self-worth a little differently, let me know in the comments. And remember stay true to yourself, set those boundaries, and keep living life with that lover energy. See you in the next one.